So uh, let's get into it. You from Queens? What part of Queens you from? Jamaica. Jamaica. The whole Jamaica too, all the way from Rosedale down to fucking Jamaica. I lived all over that shit. You know some people from Rosedale. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm like niggas in Rosedale too. Shout out to them. Shout out to Rosedale. I live in Lawson, in the South Side of the Jamaica. Yeah, I got a lot of ties to Queens because a lot of people don't know. Like I actually was born in Queens. Okay, where you from now? The Low East Side. I grew up in the I grew up in the Low East Side, but oh, okay. I, my father's side was stayed in Queens, so like I was always going to Queens. I went to high school in Queens, like I went to Queens Channel. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Far Rock. Mm-hmm. So like yeah, like I was always you know what I mean, like Queens, in Queens actually. and in the like. But I grew up in the Low. I rep the Low because that's yeah. That's you know what I mean? Good. That's why I had my first fights. My my everything. That's why I became a man. But I right, always right, showed right. love to Queens because I was actually born in Queens. Nah, that's real no shit. Yeah, real shit. I'm Queens all the way. That's what's up, though. I ain't the most. I'm Queens all the way, son. I mean, I'm carry that shit on my, on my back all the way. That's what's up. Yeah, like New York. Yeah, it's like we getting the we getting the resurgence now, mm-hmm. right? And that's why, like, in a sense, I'm glad I'm kind of stepping into like my journalist bag, in a sense where I could kind of highlight certain like artists because. Are you though? Yeah, because it's like they, they try to make it seem like you have to do drill or you have to do all right. this other shit when there's people doing like real hip hop that's like out there. So nah, that's a big fact. You know what I mean? That's why I try to get on my show. Like like the spitters. Like we ain't here to like talk about no like drama, no no bullshit. Like it's gotcha. straight like you know what I mean? Hip hop shit. Yeah, like that's what the culture needs, like you know, mm-hmm. but you, you, it's, it's just really interesting that I'm sitting here with you right now because my last interview was pretty interesting. Mm. And, um, you know, like, you being, like, from, like, any, like, back in the days, I remember listening to, like, mixtapes the first time I ever heard Graf. Mm. It was, I don't even remember the, the name of the song because it was so long ago. And I've heard so much of your other shit after that. Mm. But it was, like, a song where, like, you it had, like, shells on it. Oh, yeah, like, uh, 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 yeah, New Jack City. New Jack City. Yeah, there we go. Like that was like the first. That was the first time I think I heard rap, and I was mm-hmm. like, "Yo, who is this guy?" Right. The thing that stood out about you, that to me that makes you an interesting artist, is you lyrical, but you have like a certain like harmony to your like flow. Like mm-hmm. there's a certain cadence to your flow that that shit is not duplicated. Like it's it's. It's interesting because usually when the artist harmonizes, they depend solely on that. Mm. But you have like bars and you have like a certain like harmony like to your shit. Like it's crazy. I good look. It's a rhythm, right? I'm Jamaican or some shit. I can't call it. But it's like it's not even a harmony. Maybe it is. Maybe I'm in a certain key. I don't even know. It's yeah, more like beat. a rhythm. It's like that. Like I talk fast and shit. So it's more like a rhythm. But nah, I fuck with that. I fuck with that. Yeah, like that should be like especially with certain. Producers like when you work with certain producers, that should be mm-hmm. sounding crazy. It'd be like, yo. Then when you actually listen to the wordplay, you'd be like, wow, like that shit is crazy. Like, cause there's artists that have bars, but they don't have like that melodic, you know what I mean, right, aspect right. to their flow. It's just straight bar. It'll be like straight raw bars. Mm-hmm. But when you have a, a person that has bars and they have like a melody, like that shit is crazy. Like, nah, good looks. I appreciate that. Yeah. yeah, like I'm, I'm really like, I rap, but I'm a fan too. So like. Mm-hmm. I'm not one of those guys that, that you know what I mean, is afraid to show love. Like, I actually sit there and I break down the bars. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I'll be like, certain, certain artists, I'll just be like, wow, like, that shit makes you want to rap. Like, mm, that's what's up, nigga. Nah, that's real shit. I appreciate that. Yeah, for real. Like, it was it was a few tracks that of yours that, like, I really liked. And I just was like, wow, like, that shit made me want to, like, step my pen game up. Like, for real, like, nah, I like hearing shit like that because I, I do it for the spitters. A lot of times when I'm pen and shit, I'm like, oh, niggas ain't gonna understand this. And I might rephrase it, try to simplify it. And I'm like, man, fuck that. You get it, you get it, you don't, you don't. So I rap for rappers, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Oh, niggas that appreciate this level of penmanship. You know what I mean? Because sometimes I'll be feeling like, I gotta dumb it down, niggas gonna miss it. Then I'm like, I don't give a fuck if you miss it. Then it probably ain't for you. Or you'll get it later, nigga. You know what I'm saying? So when niggas 
get it. It's like, okay, it's like if you paint a picture, you want to do it. You want somebody to appreciate the art. Yeah, I don't do that. I don't do that. Because that's what that's what the outlets like this is for, yeah. to explain it to niggas. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know I mean, to explain right. it to the slow people. Right. Like, and I ain't gonna call them slow. So when I write stuff, I'm like, this is gonna be tricky to get, but they'll, they'll get, they ain't gotta get on the first listen. You'll, you'll get it one day. You know what I'm saying? So I don't dumb it down. Yeah, that's just that. It's like if you're a chef move right now, like, 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 like if you're a chef and you make a meal, you want niggas to appreciate what put, what you put into that meal. You ain't trying to hold back no spices, nigga. You want everybody to get every piece of flavor, but like, oh, I fuck with this meal. Right. Thanks for putting this plate together. You know what I'm saying? That's that's how I look at it. That's a fact. Right. So the, the album that you was talking about about um, mm. stop calling um, our content. Mm -hmm. That's like one of the coolest fucking. Titles that I've ever heard. Like, where did you? First off, before we even get into that, like, Graph. That's that. That's an interesting name in itself. Like, mm -hmm. when you? Where, how'd you get the name Graph? That started from, like high school. I used to draw first, spray paint, and you know, all the art shit. I was doing art just as hard as I was doing these bars. Damn, you know what I'm saying? That goes hand so, to hand. Yeah, that's like, like hip hop graphics. shit. Yeah, facts. It was like rap. I was spray painting, drawing all that shit. I got. It's, it's crazy that all the NFT shit is in style now. Cause now I'm bringing some of my old art I did back then, NFT the shit now, and, and create new art and add it to the old shit and all this other fly shit. So it's like all that art shit just paid off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that, really, that's why I rap the way I rap too. It's like I'm putting this these pictures I see in my head into words. So um, yeah, but that shit came, that came from actual art though. It's like graphic art. Or that's gangster. That's like true. Like that's hip hop. Cause the graffiti and the art all that shit, shit like I was goes all hand that. in hand. Like, yeah, I was doing all that. I was drawing on motherfucking walls, canvases, leather jackets, leather bags, all that shit. I was just doing shit. Word facts. That's crazy. 